Hello guys Mga amigo, mga amiga Time check It's 2.52 in the afternoon And it's raining Yes We're back Finally um, Kagabi si Ella Ayaw matulog Ayaw pa rin matulog ano na Mag-one na Or one o'clock One o'clock siguro ganun Tapos, siguro mga magtutunan nung umakit kami sa taas. Kaya medyo palud pa si Mama Brown. And then, um, biglang sinabi ni David na um, kailangan nating ano, bumili ng school uniform ni si Ella. So, kaninang, kanina, mga 10? Oh, 9, 10, something like that. Lumabas kami, bumili kami ng mga gamit niya sa school. Um, pakita ko na lang kung ano yung suot niya next time. So, ayun nga. Gusto ko ikwento sa inyo kung ano yung nangyari sa amin yung Oh my God, it's a nightmare what happened to us. Really a nightmare and I don't know how I've done it. Well, actually, me and Ella done it, but I'm so so proud of her because even though we had, we had that experience, we were having that experience. No, um, she was she was so good. She was really, she was well behaved. Well, from time to time, of course, she's a child. She would like just ask like, why why are we doing up and down, up and down? Why aren't we, um, going in in the airplane? Um, why are we going around? What's wrong, Mama? Like that. But aside from that, she was really good. Napaka ano niya, um, patiently waiting kumbaga. Um, alam niya na we were having troubles, but she was she was fine. And ako naman, in my case, um, I was trying not to ano panic. Um, but yeah, yun, okay naman. Tapos, ayun na nga. So, yung unang nangyari sa amin is, narong terminal kami. Um, instead of going to terminal 1, we went to terminal 3. 3. So, ayun, buti, nandun pa yung mga anak ko. So, yung van, nandun pa. Hindi pa nakakaalis. Pero tinawag ako sa kala ko, wala na. So, yung medyo malayo-layo pala yung terminal 3 sa terminal 1. So, kung hindi, sana nag-ano kami, nag-taxi na lang kami ni Ella, which is okay lang, sana kaya lang. Ang, ano, napaka-hassle kasi ang dami kung may mga luggage akong dala tapos meron akong bata. And then after that, so, it was okay, it was smooth, I thought it would be smooth na yung the whole, ano namin, journey namin, traveling journey namin, it would be okay. But then again, um, so, Manila to Beijing was okay, although eh, medyo na late lang ng konti yung ano namin, plane namin, but it was fine. But um, I thought it was okay. So, naglaland, ang, ang time namin, yung flight namin papunta, papunta, yung Beijing to London, supposed to be, it's um, 11.20 something. Oo, 11.20. Pero that time, 11.20, nandung pa kami sa ere. So, pababa pa lang talaga yung, yung, ano, yung, yung airplane. Yes? Tapos, um, so, we were at the airplane. So, noon, 11.20, nandun pa rin kami, nasa air pa rin kami, nasa air pa rin kami at 11.20. But then again, yung flight namin from Beijing to London, it was 11.20. So, nagmamadali kami nung anak kong, we were, we were running, not supposed to be running, pero kailangan talaga namin tumakbo pero eto merong merong pinay shout out dun kay I forgot her name but yeah may nakilala akong ganda niya sabi niya sa akin ate na miss mo rin yung plane sabi niya nung pares pa tayo nang ano papunta ka pa ng London sabi ko oo wala na pero sabi ko bakit nandiyan pa naman yung plane hindi sarado na raw kasi yung boarding time wala na I was like oh my god what are we gonna do sabi ko so um, pumunta kami doon sa um, sa help desk tapos sinabi na magpunta kami upstairs um, no, not upstairs eh so tama, sa upstairs tapos nung upstairs, 
ano, sabi, ah, pumunta kami yung kayo dun sa ganito. So, hindi, hindi pala dun, sabi ng isa, dun sa kabilang counter, yung isa naman kabilang counter. Siguro three times kami na ganun until na-reach namin yung yun nga, yung tamang desk na pupuntahan namin. Um, shout out also to those people in in um, uh, Beijing Airport who help us, accommodate us. Um, thank you, thank you very much. Hindi man namin nakuha yung um, flight namin talaga. Nakatransfer naman kami. Ito, another na namang um, ano yon story. So, I thought, okay, so, hindi naman, not so bad kasi 11.20 tapos 2.30 naman. So, 11, 12, 1, 2, so, what, 3 hours lang naman. Pero hindi, oh my God, 2.30 na, ano na, 2.15 na, hindi pa nagbo-boarding kasi usually 15 minutes before, eh, magbo-boarding na, wala. So, 2.30 na, wala pa rin, sabi, um, uh, sa, um, uh, Mag-intay-intay daw muna. Kanya may, may, may magdedelay ng konti. So, 3 o'clock na, wala pa rin. I was like, oh my God, what's happening? Tapos, ang sabi yung last, sabi 4.30. Tapos ng 4.30, wala pa rin. Meron daw technical difficulties. We don't know what. Hindi sila nag-explain. So, hindi ko na alam anong gagawin ko. Naghanap ako ng mga ng phone kasi yung phone ko ayaw gumana dun sa ano sa sa Beijing. Um, kahit na may internet ka hindi ka makapag-internet kasi ayaw nga talagang gumana. Tapos nakalagay doon na may internet connection ka doon sa Beijing Airport pero hindi mo naman magamit. I don't know why. Tapos hindi ko alam na Facebook and Messenger um, duo ganyan. Ang hindi siya gumagana wala para bawal yon, ban yon doon sa China. So, the only one na pwedeng gamitin is WeChat, which is kailangan, ano, China version siya. Eh, wala naman ako noon. Ano, ba't ano gagawin ko sa China version, right? So, wala. Naghanap ako ng mayroong may Wi-Fi. Wala rin sila. Hindi daw gumagana. gumagana. Tapos, yung mga phone doon na, ano, sana, ang ganda ng phone eh. Mayroong pang, ano, may screen pa na ganun kalakay pa siya TV. Naku, lahat puro out of order, out of service, mga ganyan. So, nagtatanong ko naman doon sa mga tao kung pwede ka no, hindi ka naman maintindihan. May phone naman daw ako. Hindi ko nga magamit yung phone ko. Naka, every time akong tatawag ako sa ano doon sa anak ko, ang mga anak ko, excuse me, hindi nga. Block din. Kay David, block din. Sabi ko, di ba, lang magbayad, ng, magbayad ako ng medyo mahal. Basta makausap ko lang si David. Kasi, oh my God, di mamumuti yung mata ng husband ko doon. So, yung pala, at the other end, which is here, na naghihintay si David dun sa airport. He was waiting for us at the airport. Um, he was already um, stressed and worried that um, our flight, that first flight, we weren't there. So, he was asking information, um, how come my wife and my, my daughter is not, not on that plane, blah, blah. So, they're not really giving anything to him. Um, sabi sa kanila, sabi sa kanya, you need to um, phone the police, ganyan, kasi we can't give you any details about um, them both because for security reasons. But then again, asawa at saka anak niya kami, uh, I mean, asawa at saka anak yung inaano niya, diba, hinahanap niya, pero they can't really do it. So, um, tumawag ng police yung asawa ko, and then he, he asked, uh, he he um, filed for, ano, missing person, which is kami nga, dalawa nung anak ko. Tapos, dumating yung police daw dun sa airport, tapos, ano, pinuntahan nila yung police immigration. So, dun pa lang sila nagbigay ng, ano, information about us, which is like, four hours after four hours something. So, five, more, ano, nearly five hours to get yung asawa ko dun sa airport. Tapos nung sinabi na ng asa, nung, nung ano nga sa immigration na immigration officer doon na um, wala yung, as, yung asawa at saka anak mo dyan sa flight na yan kasi nasa ano sila, nasa isang flight sila, na miss nila yung flight na yan. Nung sinabi daw yun yung asawa ko, bless him, um, nag-iyak siya. Parang yung stress niya doon yun. So, hinuhold niya, hinuhold niya. Tapos sabi ng polis sa kaya, are you okay? Tapos nagla na lang daw siya umiyak. Kasi Mia, at least alam ko na safe yung asawa at yung anak ko. So, yun. Gusto ko lang kayo i-update about that. Kasi diba naka, meron akong binidyo na 
wrong terminal, yung mga ganyan. Tsaka meron din akong video na i-upload na yun nga, na-miss namin yung flight. Tapos yung horrible experience namin ng anak ko na nag-up and down, up and down kami dun sa airport na yun. Oh my God. I nearly fainted and I nearly cried but I'm trying to um, get hold of myself because of Ella. I don't want her to see me panicking. You know, um, ayoko, I don't want her to worry. You know, that are we gonna be fine, mama, like that. So, you know, so I'm really, really, really proud of her. She was really, really good. Yun. So, ang ano ko lang sa inyo, sa mga, um, sa mga viewers na, yung sa mga subscribers ko na, um, kahit sino, yung mga umaalis, especially sa China, make sure na meron kayo um, way para kontakin yung family nyo or wherever, you know, na meron kayong um, meron kayong pwedeng ipang-contact sa family nyo just in case mangyari, yung nangyari katulad sa amin ni Ella um, so yeah, siguro thank God that's, that's it, we're here, we're home um, mga pala we're already in the new house as you can see see um, yan. Tada! I love my kitchen. Yes, ayan. Lighter side tayo. Um, I new utility room. I have a utility room. And here's the whole of the kitchen. I'll go there, yeah. Pero i uh, house tour ko kayo siguro um tomorrow or ayan ko. Pasensya na kayo sa mga boxes kasi ngayon pa lang kami mag Kahapon lang nag-start yung asawa kong mag, ano, magpasok ng mga boxes. So, ayan, marami pa kayong makikita ng boxes. Mga, siguro mga 2 days, 3 days pa ako mag-aayos. So, yun lang. Um, for now, let's um, stop this. Let's, ano, iaan ko na yung vlog, itong vlog na to. And subscribe na lang, guys. Um, follow me and I follow you. I hug you and I mean, hug me and I hug you. Bye.